The whole of Africa's LGBTQ community feared it as Uganda's parliament cheered it, ignoring warnings from the West to pass the harshest anti-gay law in the world. Lawmakers declared victory. If you perform a sexual act with a person of the same sex, then you have committed the offense of homosexuality. And what is the punishment? Imprisonment for life. So-called aggravated homosexuality, including gay sex while infected with HIV, can carry the death penalty. Those who help the LGBTQ community also face up to 20 years in prison. Activists were in tears. Where are we supposed to go? How did we become refugees in our own countries? In the West, the new law was condemned. U.S. President Joe Biden calling it a tragic violation of universal human rights. He's considering additional steps, including sanctions. Prime Minister Justin Trudeau tweeted, This law is appalling and abhorrent, and we strongly condemn it. We have to remain vigilant on LGBTQIS plus uh, rights here in Canada, and we have to stick up for them around the world as well. Those who help LGBTQ refugees flee now fear a ripple effect of similar laws through countries like Ghana and Nigeria and beyond Africa. We're also experiencing a regression of rights uh, all around the world. Um, there is a very well-funded, coordinated effort in many countries around the world, including the United States. Uganda is resisting any pressure to backtrack planning instead to look for political and financial support from like-minded countries as it loses it elsewhere. Sasha Petrosik, CBC News, Toronto.